That looked like video footage rather mm. than uh, CGI, didn't uh, it? Uh, well, I th uh, yeah, are those computer graphics? They are computer They're graphics. They're amazing. They I are, mean, aren't they? When I go back to my youth, mm. when I was on my ZX81 and my Atari, those graphics <laughs> really weren't that good, let me tell you. <laughs> I had a 16-bit Sega Mega Drive. I Did still you? play it to this day. Sonic the Hedgehog, <laughs> the Lion King game. I absolutely love it. Loads of my friends do this. So a lot of my friends are actors and they um, they go to do these sessions where they're in a green screen room, like the studio, and they have all these dots put on yes. their bodies and but their movement is tracked. I can't remember what it's called now, but yeah, it's quite a lucrative business for actors. Amazing. Yeah, I mean, honestly, the, the technology now, it, and I couldn't, the blurring between what is actually real and what is not it's real. It's terrifying though. David, well, they're going to take our jobs. Well, I think that's part, part of the problem, but also just in terms of young people and children and they then can't discern what is actually real and what is not real anymore and so the boundaries are blurred and going yes. back to Grand Theft Auto you said it's a very it's well it's pretty dramatic and violent game extremely violent game yeah I should absolutely say that there should be restrictions on the kind of mm. things that you can do on those kind of games particularly if you're under 18. Mm. Yeah, absolutely right. Uh, we made it serious. We, you see we, that? we, we took a lighthearted <laughs> story. We did. Now, someone who